On the first day of the week, Mary Magdalene came to the tomb early while it was still dark, and she saw that the stone had been rolled away from the tomb. And she ran and came to Simon Peter and to the other disciple whom Jesus loved and said to them, They have taken away the Lord out of the tomb, and we do not know where they have laid him. Peter went out and the other disciple, and they were going to the tomb. So they both ran together. And the other disciple outran Peter and came to the tomb first. And he, stooping down and looking in, saw the linen wrappings lying there. But he did not go in. When Simon Peter came, following him, and went into the tomb and saw the linen cloths lying there, and the handkerchief that had been around his head, not lying with the linen cloths, but folded together in a place by itself. Then the other disciple who came to the tomb first went in also, and he saw, and he believed. For as of yet they did not know the scripture, that he must rise again from the dead. And then the disciples went away to their own homes. But Mary stood outside the tomb weeping. And as she wept, she stooped down and looked into the tomb. And she saw two angels in white sitting, one at the head and the other at the feet where the body of Jesus had been lying. And they said to her, Woman, why are you weeping? And she said to them, Because they have taken away my Lord, and I do not know where they have laid him. Now when she had said this, she turned around and saw Jesus standing there, but did not know that it was Jesus. And Jesus said to her, Woman, why are you weeping? Whom are you seeking? And she, supposing him to be a gardener, said to him, Sir, if you have carried him away, tell me where you have laid him, and I will take him away. And Jesus said to her, Mary. And she turned probably drying her eyes that were filled with tears, and focused, and said, Rabboni, which means teacher. And Jesus said to her, Do not cling to me, for I have not yet ascended to my Father. But go and tell my brethren, and say to them that I am ascending to my Father and your Father, my God and your God. And Mary Magdalene came and told the disciples that she had seen the Lord and that he had spoken these things to her. Easter is a time of glorious celebration. It is a time of of celebration because Jesus still lives. And Jesus lives now. Jesus can be called upon to help. Jesus is waiting to help each one of us. He is as close as our prayers. And I believe that he has come again the minute we realize and become aware that he is now here. Dear wonderful friend. I wish you and your family a very, very happy Easter and a magical time of realizing that the resurrection is something that is still occurring as we rise in our awareness to realize the greatness of the message. God bless you.